this is Jonathan from Spot of London, today I'm in Wembley and I'm showing you a four bedroom house. So here we are, this is the house. Hello, we have the entrance here. So actually here we have some hooks, uh, you also have some space for storage, for shoes. And so this is the corridor here on the ground floor. So as you can see we have a big mirror and here first we have the bathroom and the utility room, also the access to the garage. Then we have the study room, kitchen, dining room, bedroom number one and the living room. So let's start from here. Uh, this is the living room and as you can see it's really big and it's looking really really good. So we have a TV here, flat screen TV. Uh, we have two big sofas and we have like, I mean you can see the street from here so it's a really nice living room and so that's the staircase to the upper floor and I'm showing you first now the bedroom, bedroom number one, the only one that it's available here in the house. So we have a chest of drawers on the right and then we have a double bed with bedside table. We also have a soft chair, TV. We have like really views here, it's just the house next door. But uh, you have plenty of light coming in. And we also have a built-in wardrobe, which is really big. We have the rail here, and the landlord told me that he's gonna uh, put here some more shelves, so you have more available space. All right, so this was the bedroom, bedroom number one. And what will show you first, now here the so this is the first bathroom, and you will see that there is no bath. So at the moment it's just a toilet with a sink, but the landlord will add a bath tub here. And next door we have the laundry room, the utility room. So we have the dryer and the washing machine, and also a big fridge here. And that's access to the garage and also access to the garden so this was the bathroom or toilet there's gonna be a bathroom and here we have two closets and that's the study room from the landlord and this is the kitchen really nice kitchen as well you have anything you could need here so that's the the microwave, here for example we have plenty of glasses, cups, mugs, there's the coffee machine, that's a gas, the stove with the oven, here we have plates, bowls, cutlery, we have our fry pans, pots, we have everything you could need, also the kettle, toaster. We have here a big fridge, but again you have an additional fridge in the utility room and the freezer so this is the kitchen i'll show you now the dining room so we have the dining table here and but the landlord told me that he will bring extra furniture so it's, a, it's actually a really really big room and here we have access to the garden. It's raining at the moment, so I will show you just everything from here. So we have the porch, a uh, porch with a few tables, sorry, a few, a few chairs. And we have all the garden here. It's a lovely, lovely garden with a willow tree. All right, so that was the garden. 
And now let's go upstairs. So upstairs we have three more bedrooms, but those bedrooms uh, are from the landlord. So I will show you just, so that will be bedroom number two, bedroom number three, four, and a playroom. And this is the, and the full bathroom at the moment. So on the right, we have the shower, heating rails, and we have the bathroom, sorry, the bathtub, toilet, sink, we also have a mirror with some space for storage. So that's the whole bathroom. And so, that's all. So that was the four bedroom house in Wembley. As you have seen in the video, the house looks nice, it's in good condition. And the thing that I like the most from the house is that we have plenty of uh, spare space here, uh, common areas like the, we have a big living room, a big, really big dining room, uh, two bathrooms, a really nice kitchen, a really huge garden. So it's a really nice house. It's uh, in a really quiet area, but not really far from, from the station in Wembley where you have anything you could need, plenty of shops, uh, supermarkets, bars, pubs, restaurants, stadium, cinema, everything. Anyway, if you want to find out anything else, go to spotahorn.com, you'll find everything there. This was Jonathan for Spotahorn London. See you next time. Bye bye.